Right. All right, so one of the other requirements here of this project is that you have a border, and that border has to be a quarter inch by a quarter inch away on all four sides. So in order to do that, we're gonna now mark, so you can see how I've numbered all of my uh, lines here. So each one of these spaces is 100 thousandths above, and I'm gonna come over to a quarter of an inch. Well, at a quarter of an inch, here's 100, 200, uh, sub quarter 250 or a quarter of an inch just between the 200 and 300 so I'm going to imagine the exact center of that and I'm going to do the same thing in the Y 250 thousand so this point is 250 thousandths up and 250 thousandths over I'm doing the same thing in all four corners here because this line next that I draw is going to represent the border lines that I'm gonna put on here. So, so here's the border lines. So, and I'm using this because we're gonna write the program. So depending on what size cutting tool you're using, the edge of the cutting tool that you program is gonna be programmed up to this line. And we're gonna to need to make sure that we center that on there to get that to be a quarter of an inch away on all four sides. So, all right, so there's the border. Now, once I've got my border, so I know at this point then, I can take whatever the object is and I can start to trace that out and know where to put it. Now, you can kind of see the rough line. Now I'm using this then to kind of put some points on here or you can trace it so you can trace your image or your logo on there. But what we ultimately need is to come up with the coordinate points that we're gonna to use to write our program on. So this is how we set this up in order to uh, determine how we're gonna write the program for this particular project that we're working on. Okay, now, with that being said, so, so you can trace this out. Now, notice here with yours, 